Hello, I'm Vanessa Abernathy, president of the Robinson County Arts Council. I'd like to introduce you to Faye Middleton. Thank you, Vanessa. And we're honored to have you and to have Bella Venti here in our garden today. Now I'd like to introduce you to Susie Swenson, who is pianist for the Bella Venti. Welcome to River Voices in Lumberton. And today we are the guests on the wonderful patio of the Robinson County History Museum. This group is Bella Venti, Woodwind Quintet, and I'm their pianist when they need one. I'd like to introduce them to you. Sarita Jackson clarinet from Fayetteville. She has a Bachelor of Music Ed and a Masters of Music Ed from UNC Pembroke. And she's performed as a concert band and orchestra at UNCP, Methodist University Band, etc. Uh, she's also performed with the Band of Directors Jazz Ensemble of Robinson County and with the Fayetteville Symphonic Band. She teaches privately in the and in the Cumberland County School System. Our French horn player is Kimberly McGill. She's originally from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, where she performed in the Pittsburgh Youth Symphony throughout high school and college. She studied music performance at Indiana University in Pennsylvania. Yes, there are two Indiana universities. Mm -hmm. yeah. Later, Kim was principal horn with the West Virginia University Community Orchestra in Morgantown for nine years. And since 2011, she's played horn with the Wilmington Symphony. She's also a member of the newly created Wilmington Symphony, Symphonic Winds and the Horns of the Sandfields. Next is Danielle Sable, oboe and English horn both double reads. Oboist Danielle has been a music educator for more than a decade and has spent those years at Pembroke Middle School. During her time as their band director, she assumed many roles. She has coached, mentored, created curricula, handled public relations, and served as the school's webmaster. Danielle is originally from Missouri, Ohio, a small town near Youngstown, and she attained her Bachelor of Music Ed from Youngstown State University, and her Master of Arts in Music Ed from the University of North Carolina, Pembroke. She's been playing her oboe for more than 25 years, and has performed with professional orchestra all along the, the East Coast. Carlos Tyson flute is a graduate of the University of North Carolina, Pembroke, where he received the Bachelor of Music Education degree. He was born in Oklahoma and has lived in Germany and Japan, experiencing Army family life. He performed with the UNCP Concert Band and the Methodist University Concert Band. He is a composer of some of the pieces for Bella Venti, which you will hear today. He's currently an elementary music teacher in Cumberland County Schools and is actively involved in Fayetteville's local Boy Scouts and Cub Scouts, and his son is a participant. Carlos and his wife Amber have three young children. Eric Swenson Bassoon is originally from Central Texas, where he first played bassoon in high school. instruments besides bassoon include recorders, dulcian, Irish whistle, concertina, 
guitar, mandolin, and a collection of ethnic flutes. Eric is retired from a career in electronics and information technology, and he resides with me, his wife, in Fairmont, and is an active part of his church music ministry. Last but not least is myself, Susie Swenson. I am Susie McDaniel Swenson, a native of Fairmont. I graduated University of North Carolina Greensboro with a bachelor's degree in piano performance. I continued at Eastman School of Music, University of Rochester, New York, for a master's degree and further education in jazz, electronic music, and third stream at New England Conservatory of Music in Boston. I am a, a professor emerita of music at the Community College of Rhode Island where I taught for 36 years and was chair of the music department for 21 years. And during my work as chair, we received we really work for it, I'm telling you. We receive national accreditation as a music department. Okay, the first piece we're going to play for you today is a suite written in 1902 by Charles Kepp, a French composer. He attended the Paris Conservatory of Music and became an award-winning French organist and prolific composer. He was mentored by the famous Charles Marie Vidor. The suite has three movements, the, the entree, the andantino, and the rondo finale.
program <clears throat> is Moon River, written in 1960 by Henry Mancini, musician, and Johnny Mercer, lyricist. This piece was written for the movie Breakfast at Tiffany's, and it was originally sung by none other than Audrey Hepburn. <laughs> Awards for this song include Academy Award for Original Song, Grammy Awards for Record of the Year and Song of the Year. And the song's success relaunched Johnny Mercer's career as a song lyricist. The real Moon River, and there really is one, is near Savannah, Georgia, where originally the Back River was renamed to honor native Savannah son Johnny Mercer. Moon River. Thank you. 
piece, a, another suite, it's a collection of dances. It's called Five Easy Dances, but we assure you they are not easy to perform. Uh, anyway, they were written in 1956 by Danis Age, who lived 1911 to 2007. He's a Hungarian-born American composer, conductor, pianist, and author. He wrote film scores as well as piano pieces, which still delight young students. These stylized dances are neither easy to play nor easy for dancing. If you want to try it back there in the back, go ahead. The five dances are polka from the Czech Republic, tango from Argentina, bolero from Spain, waltz, always associated with Vienna, and rumba, which is Afro-Cuban. Afro Thank <laughs> you. 
who established the first urban Brazilian popular music during the time shortly before World War I. This is his famous piece played and sometimes sung, such as by Carmen Miranda, I Didn't Bring My Fruit Bonnet. Uh, the title has been translated as Sparrow in the Cornmeal. Thank you. 
hope to meet him sometime when Eric and I are in Plano, Texas with relatives. Uh, we, we are in touch with him and he has actually sent us a piece to record for him for the quintet. Um, he's a member of the Dallas Wind Symphony and the Celtic Jazz Group. Get this for a title of a group. Five Second Rule. Lovrian founded the award-winning winning Texas Saxophone Quartet. He plays saxophone and Irish whistle, is a composer and internet web designer and music publisher. He's well known and respected in Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex area. Listen at the end of this piece, A Balloon on the Breeze, and you'll actually hear the balloon pop. mentioned in the introductions that Carlos Tyson has composed some music for us and we're going to play some of that now. This is a piece called Moon Kissed. It was written in 2014. It's an evening dance mood piece composed by Carlos Tyson, the flutist, who happens to be of Puerto Rican descent. The moon is represented by the bass line played by the bassoon. Thank you. 
this afternoon is called Moonbeam and I think he ultimately intends to have a suite of these moon dances. It, uh, it's his second composition and it was created a few years later than Moon Kiss and the music of Moonbeam represents the moon smiling during a dance. The main melody is passed around among the instruments while the bassoon represents the moon in the bass line. Thank you. 